Hi everybody, it's Oksana. So today I thought I'd do something a little different and I would do a Trader Joe's haul because I do a lot of um, grocery hauls of things that I buy online like Vitacost and a Trader Joe's I feel like is another really neat place and it's not online, it's a physical store but they have a lot of really neat products and I thought it'd be really fun to show you guys kind of my favorite things there and the things that I think that are really great uh, that they make because you know, they're really unique. A lot of them are you know, just their own brand and you can't get it anywhere else, although they do sell some things that are, you know, bigger brands that you can find other places. But like 90% of their stuff is their own Trader Joe's brand. Um, and I think that they have really good prices on most things. So it's really economical to shop there too. And I just did grocery shopping this morning so now I figured it's like the perfect time this isn't literally everything that I ever you know buy there but I just it's most things it's what I happened to, to buy there this week so um, I brought my shopping bag up here so I can show you guys so first of all since I already showed you the coconut sugar they have a really good deal on their coconut sugar it's organic coconut sugar and it's cheaper than most brands um, I don't know if it's cheaper than like every single thing on, you know, of coconut sugar on Vitacost. I haven't compared. Um, I, I think this is like $2.99 or $3.99. I don't know, but it's a really, really good deal for the big bag of organic coconut sugar. It's a 16 ounces. So if you use coconut sugar, um, this is great. And same deal with almond meal. Their almond meal is also a really good deal. I think this is $3.99. I don't know. It probably varies also like across the country in different areas. But um, I like that this is not blanched. It's just actual almonds with like the skin on them and everything. That's why you see little speckles. I use this a lot for cooking and baking. So this is great as well. And next we have some of their uh, fair trade organic 72% cacao. Belgian dark chocolate. It's organic. And I like that the ingredients in here are so plain. It's uh, cacao mass, cane sugar, and cacao butter. So there's literally, oh, my dog is in here today. He like really wanted to be in here while I film and now he's gonna growl at like everything, of course, throughout my video. Um, so just like three ingredients, it's vegan, very, very basic. So I think that's great. And then if you are not a fan of dark chocolate, they also have this great um, organic milk chocolate. So this does have milk, um, so it is not dairy free. Um, but this is just a really nice yummy milk chocolate and it's organic and I use this um, as a treat sometimes. Like right now, <laughs> we're, we're working on potty training with my youngest, so this like a little piece of this makes a good treat because he really likes this. And then this is just an empty box. But they have a really nice um, organic pizza. They have several. There's one that's my favorite that has uh, broccoli on it. I think it's pesto and it has broccoli and it's so good. But this is the one that my kids will eat. <laughs> I mean, they don't eat the green pizza. My, my daughter like asks if I'm like, we're having pizza. She's like, is it the green pizza or the regular pizza? Uh, so this is great because it's organic. And it's a frozen pizza, so I like having this in my freezer so that when, you know, you really need something in a pinch, like maybe you just don't have time to cook dinner, or maybe it's the end of the week and you're just out of everything, <laughs> and you haven't had a chance to go grocery shopping yet, it's just a great thing because it'll sit in your freezer forever until you need it, you know, kind of in case of emergency kind of thing for me, and I think that's great. Then along the same lines, they also have an organic, um, just a pizza crust. So sometimes I like to get that instead because it's more fun for the kids. They can like put the sauce on and the cheese on all by themselves. And it's a, more entertainment that way, but it also takes longer. So in, in that instance, it's not as great if you <laughs> have like 10 minutes to prepare dinner. Next, I have some produce. Um, they have a good selection of organic produce and it's really affordable and I like to get my celery there and I don't have it with me but also they have organic carrots just like a mixture 
Um, I like, it's purple, yellow, and orange carrots all mixed together. Just, you know, the stand, not like baby carrots, but big whole <laughs> raw carrots. And um, I use this for making soup. And then they sometimes <laughs> have organic lemons. So here's a bag. I use these a lot. I make kind of like, not really smoothies, because I don't put fruit in them. But I guess like a mixture of vegetables <laughs> that I eat. Um, and then organic kiwis as well. And they have a lot more. I mean, it just depends on what you like and what you eat and what you cook with. I think I got the last of it here. <laughs> I'm pulling it all out. This big bag on the floor. I really like, and this one I had in my house. It's been already open. I just wanted to show it to you guys. Um, I really like their liquid stevia. It's a good value and that's just like a good quality stevia if you happen to use it which I do this is something that I wanted to show you guys that they did not have this time around so I didn't get uh, but every time that they do have it in stock I get it that's the thing is sometimes things tend to get out of stock at my Trader Joe's it's a pretty small store if you've never been it's smaller than Whole Foods and it's always like so packed <laughs> so um, they didn't have the dried mango the organic dried mango but my kids really love this so I'll buy it there for them it's a good snack and then um, I bought these this time to try I haven't tried them before but I've tried some of their other ones uh, organic corn chip dippers they have a lot of organic varieties of corn chips and tortilla chips. Um, these ones are only organic corn, organic um, sunflower oil, and sea salt. So just three ingredients. And then this is a sauce that I discovered there recently. It's a brown sugar barbecue sauce in marinade. And this is really, really yummy. And last but not least, this is a new item that they recently got. That's another thing is they're always getting like all these cool new products. And they have so many like interesting snacks and like frozen foods and meals that you you just don't see these things anywhere else. So it's a really neat um, store if you've never been. So they got these dried baby bananas, and they I'm sorry you guys for this, but they look like dog poo. Um, and like my son like dropped one on the floor one time, and my, my daughter was like, the dogs pooped on the floor. <laughs> But it's not, it was the, I'll open them for you guys. They're funny. They're really good. My kids don't actually like these. I buy these for myself because I'm the only one that likes them. But I personally think that they're really good. And now I cannot open them to show you. There we go. So they're like these tiny little dried out bananas. But they're really good. In my opinion. So that is it. Um, oh, I have a little note here of things that I also like to buy there that I happen to not have with me. Um, so I really like their smoked salmon. They have a wild caught, um, what is that called? Sockeye <laughs> salmon. Um, and my kids, my son especially really likes the smoked salmon there and I'll put it, I'll make him a bagel with cream cheese and smoked salmon. He really likes that. It's like a weird thing for a two year old to like, but, um, so that's really good. It is expensive, but it's a lot cheaper than other places. So that is it. That is kind of a Trader Joe's haul, but also mostly just me talking about the food that I like there because some of it is just obviously like empty packages and boxes that I brought just to show you guys some things that I like from there that I like to buy there. So anyways, um, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.